Still in Nigeria, there is a twist to the story of an attack that reportedly claimed over 60 lives in some communities in Kaduna State. In the northwest part of Nigeria, authorities said 66 persons were killed by unknown gunmen in Kajuru on Friday night. Among the dead were 22 women and 12 children. But some of the residents are telling a different story. CGTN's uh, Deji Badmas has more on that. This is one of the communities in Kajuru local government area of the northwest Kaduna state. But authorities say 66 villagers were killed in a nighttime attack on Friday, February 15th. Indeed, there was an attack in the community and the signs are clearly visible. But there's a catch. The residents say, contrary to the report put out by the state government, the attack actually happened much earlier. This incident took place on Sunday, the, the 10th of February. 10th of February was when this incident took place. So if they are referring to this incident, certainly uh, it cannot be what they are saying. We expected government to have made a press release since either Monday or Tuesday at most. But if that reference is being made to this incident, then I am taken aback because we are not aware of any incident that took place in Kajiru local government as a whole yesterday, Friday, the 15th of, Fe uh, you know, 15th February, no. It's very shocking to everybody around here. And we stand to say nothing like that has ever happened. I don't know, I don't know whether it's a ploy to truncate the elections which was to take place on Saturday, but we're very happy that you people came and so by yourself, you will be able to go and report exactly what your eyes saw and what you hear from the real people who are here and not from any other place. On the death toll which state authorities had put at 66, they say the casualty figure is way lower and that the attackers were strange heads men. In total, we lost six males and five females in the community. There's no trace as to where they might have come from, for they came in the night, under night cover. And after the finished the operation, nobody can tell exactly the direction they took. And what surprises us most is that we've never had, there has never been any record of any clash between the Fulani and the native Adara. Our suspicion, anyway, is that it can never be the locals, the local Fulani that would, uh, we have been, that will say maybe have been grazing their cattle into our farms and there, it cannot be them. Because they, we have never had any clash with them. Five of the dead in the community are buried in these graves. And while the community mourns its dead, there's still several unanswered questions over the attack, including the narrative of the government. Deji Badmos, CGTN, Kaduna, Nigeria.